I'm hot. I'm sorry. Taking off stuff. Okay, in front of you. Um, thank you. You clapped for me, and I didn't get a chance to say thank you for that. Um, okay, so with that being said, um, I'm gonna do this piece, and, and you can feel free to clap. You know, you know, some feet, whatever. It's got some rhythm to it, you know. So it's like, uh, 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 uh. I recognize that I'm all that I got, so I realize that I can't be what I am. I'm just a poet from a county block. I'm just a poet. I'm, I'm just a poet. I'm, I'm just a poet. But I do rock. I've had to come to grips with that, and not your average artist. It's not professing to be the best, but yes, I'm one of the smartest. Go, go, be in my feet for growth. I'm working my hardest to blend poetry in with my everyday speech. And if you like it, emotion and look down at my feet. I make movies with my diction, action flicks when I speak. I move in a storyline from conception to present time. Failure is not an option because we're like a rewind. There's no time for second chances. Rise high, but circumstances. My life far from romantic, so it's hard to understand it. I recognize that I'm all that I got. So uh, I realize that I can't be what I'm not. I'm, I'm just a poet from a county block. I'm just a poet. I'm, I'm just a poet. I'm, I'm just a poet who's unpredictable. I am prototypical. My path elliptical. Come after to be continued. You can't contain me in a phrase or an open mic. I follow, etc. I got skills. A plethora. One will get next to you. If not, to heck with you. Got plenty of recognition. Your lack of admiration is my ammunition to be the bigger person. No more bad fighting. No more suffering. Love is about healing. So call me buffering. I, I, But I, sometimes I put myself in other people's positions and come up with these story-like things. And I ain't gonna preface it. You. You'll get it. Passion fruity. Brothers walking around here doing double duty. Passion fruity. <laughs> Grace and lock the closet, but she had the key. Passion fruity. She used it, lost the spirit. She used it, lost the spirit. She used it, lost the spirit while setting his free. Over oh, passion fruity, he sits quietly in the corner with his man. Knowing that his passion is a bland, is laced with a sweet taste, almost fruity. But he looks his wife in the eye and tells her he loves it because he feels like it's his duty. Lying in sheets. Lying, he holds her hand in the streets, gripping his own tongue with his teeth, scared it would betray him. His lies become unsheathed, and she wonders why he's always so slow to speak with her. But we'll stop everything to activate his cell phone, speaking to holler at Roger, but that's what men do. We'll roll with the boys, find joy and bonding, but they don't watch football together. They meet at the mall or at the church hall where I'm singing praises, bouncing off walls, thanking God for giving me love, true. But he sits only next to Roger in the pew, even when I'm not in the choir loft. But that's his boy. Nothing I can do. It's some man though. But I do see how he looks at Roger's sister. I hope he's not going places with her using his boy as a cover. I wonder. I wonder if she notices the way I look in his eyes. Sees his hand on my thigh in the sanctuary. His touch makes me high, and it's, it's all a little scary, and I'm wrong for cheating. But I've been momentarily weakened every single weekend, but I'm not gay. I'm just experimenting. And she gets plenty of loving. I guess no complaining that we're married, so we don't use protection. She gets suspicious if I start a barrier placement. Well, honestly, y'all, I like penetration. 
So I close my eyes to escape whenever he puts it in. Pretending like this isn't what it is, so I don't know where he's been or if he had anything because I, I don't ask. I just like the pressure he supplies with more than just his hands and if she will ever to find out she'd be hard pressed to understand that I need this. And I need her too. Every man has an image he must adhere to. What else can I do? Now, Roger has another perspective, because his reality is different. He's honest with himself about his lifestyle, does what he needs to do with a smile, and people love him if they know or if they don't. And he's trying hard not to fall in love with a married man. There's no need for another heartbreaking, but he's like a drug zone, and he's drawn to it. His style, his intellect, his scent. And that's exactly how she describes it. So they both sit, separate, passion, fruit, tea steeping, wife and lover, ready to partake of it, hasty, unknowing that he loves and protects only him, reveling in his hidden passions, far from bland. He makes sure that it's tasty, almost fruit. Fruity, see he be passion fruity. Brothers walking around here doing a double duty. Passion fruity. Embrace and lock the closet, but she had the key. So one night he slips. He slips a kiss to his sweetie in his sleep. Says, baby, please take me. Flips the position, reverse spooning, awakens suddenly. She says nothing. Raj, please take me. She says nothing. Watching the key turning. Unsure what she's seeing, hearing, feeling her heart her soul achy. He grabs for him. He grasps her skin. She realizes his affliction, his affinity for cheating, so she forces him to feel her, realize what he is doing. A rude awakening to her on his cell phone, simply communicating. Roger, he's calling for you in his sleep. My husband, I shouldn't be hearing this conversation. Here he is. Take him. He sits baffled. Appearances trampled. And she shackled, forcing to give him his freedom. Passion fruity, brothers walking around here doing double duty. Passion fruity, embrace and lock the closet, but she had the key. Passion fruity, she used it, lost her spirit. She used it, lost her spirit. She used it, lost her spirit while setting his. Free. I'm gonna. I'm, I plan on doing one more piece. Um, so I'm just gonna do one more piece. Is that good, Alan? Do one more piece. Oh, you sure? Okay. Okay. You know, depending on how y'all feel about this, maybe you want me to do one more. I don't know. It's up to you. But I'll, I'll do. Okay. I've never seen that outfit before. I've never seen that outfit before. Okay.